Hello? Hello? Hello. I'm sorry, let me turn the phone on my phone. Say what? Hi. Hi. What's your name, wow. babe? I'm David Chris. Your name is what? David, David Chris. Your name is David? Yeah, yeah, David. David, okay, David. And uh, how is it, where are you calling me, you calling me from, David? Okay, I'm calling from Nigeria. You're in Nigeria, okay. How old are you, David? Yeah. I'm 34. 34. September last year, me 34. 34. Yeah. But what you do for a living? I'm a fitness trainer and a bodybuilder. I work in the gym. Okay, you work, work in the gym. You're a trainer, bodybuilder. Yeah. You, have, you have any kids? Yeah, I have a son. Um, he has my son, but it doesn't stay with me. Oh, oh, oh you guys show us a picture. Oh, he's, he's cute. Yeah, that's my son. He stays with my mom in, in another state. So I stay in Lagos. I live in Lagos. Live but in my Lagos. son... Yeah, but my son is with my mom in other states, far away from me. Far, far away from you. Okay, yeah. show and tell. Show and tell. He's a cute little boy. All right, David, Nigeria, thirty-four, fitness bodybuilder. Um, what kind of woman are you looking for, honey? Well, all I want is a woman with understanding. Be having a child is not really matters because I already have a son. So all I want is a nice woman. You know, respectful, God fearing. So what I mean, respectful, not that she should lie down for me over everything. She just have this body, this self control. You know how to be with a man. That's just all I want. Because well, a woman who to... understand, a woman who understand how to treat a man would definitely want to be with the man. Not every woman that wants to be with a man really wants because they understand. It. It's not there. So I just feel that all I want is a woman with understanding that can be with a man. Yeah. He wants a woman with understanding that knows how to be with a man. Okay. Um, what are your deal breakers? Sorry? What are your deal breakers? I don't understand what that means. Sorry. What are your non-negotiables? Like, what will you not tolerate? Oh, 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 okay. Well, what I will not tolerate in a relationship is cheating. That's all. Cheating. Okay. That's all, right. all. Let's do the Kendra Cam. Excuse me. Let's do the Kendra Cam. That's the other thing. Let's do the Kendra Cam. That's when you stand up and we see your full body. Oh, okay. I'm putting on shorts because there's um. Are you, are you are you the Nigerian incredible hawk? Are you the I'm sorry. I'm in, yeah, I'm a Nigerian. I'm in my I'm in my house. I know, but your body is like one of them. What was going on? What just happened? <laughs> what in the world? <laughs> okay. 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 All right. Um. Um. David is your name, right? Yeah. Do you want a woman in Nigeria? Well, um, to be honest with you, I don't want a woman in Nigeria. But if I will accept a woman in Nigeria, you know, before I will accept to say about that, let me just say one or two things. You know, Nigerian women, a lot of them, they are cheaters and they don't have this mindset of settling down with a man in love yeah let me just be honest all they want is what they want to get from you you know i'm not trying to discriminate or spoiling anybody here but this is my people i really know them okay but the reason why i want a woman outside nigeria you know america london any part is because they understand love more than Nigerians. Yeah. I give them credit on that. Can I ask you a question? Have you ever been to America? No, I've never yeah. been. But I have friends. I have a friend that, you know, they are married there. They were in Nigeria. They're married there. 
and we are living happy and some people i train some people online you know i train some people online outside nigeria and america and other part of the country so i have this idea about what i'm saying so that's it i was gonna say how can you speak about american women you've never been to america no i understand them a little bit because they know how to love the reason why sometimes it seems that marriage stuff is not working for them because their man cheat a lot yeah american men cheat a lot once the woman gets Back to one or two, they feel that you are no longer relevant to them. They treat you anyhow. I know what I'm saying. I've never been to America before, but I have friends and I see, I, I observe these things. You know, I communicate with my clients. And when I look at the old situation, the men are very, very horrible. I'm telling you the truth. Yeah. The, the women are loving. The women are loving. They are 100% loving and ready to be with their men. But once the men, you know, give birth to do with them with one kid or two kid or three kids they feel that they are no longer important you know they start going around looking for somebody and that's where the divorce stuff you know comes from so, so that is it so do you want the american woman to move to nigeria with you it doesn't really matter if nigeria is a safe place and we respect the foreigners a lot we respect and value the foreigners a lot so if it happens that she come here, we, we, we live over here, it's fine. If we go over there, it's also fine for me, as long as we understand each other. Are you able to go to America? Well, to be honest, for now, um, it's not easy, except the woman has to come over. Yeah, then get married and go. That's, that's the only way it can be easy for now. So it would be hard to date because it seems like in order for you to date an American woman, she has to marry you. That's another thing. That's a big thing. That's not another thing. That's the main thing, David. What the hell? That's another thing. Oh, by the way, uh, we have to get married. Oh, David, listen, honey. No, 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 no. Don't get me. Doubt, no. I was trying to get you the benefit of the doubt because so many Nigerian men feel as though I'm always saying that they just want green cards. No. And I do believe no. that everybody no, in no, 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 no. Hold on, hold on. But I'm going to keep okay. it honest with you. It does seem okay. as though it does seem as though you want an American woman because you want a green card. That's what it seems like. No, no, I swear to God, no, that's not what I'm is in my mind. God. Okay, I'm being I'm honest. Swear on God, don't you better not? Oh. You better take it back. You I'm, better take it back. You I'm better sorry. take it back. It's the beginning of 2004. I'm not swearing to God. Okay, I'm not swearing to God. You better stop swearing on God, lying. I'm sorry. I'm not swearing to God. Yeah. Okay, I take it back. Take it back, because that was a lie. All right. Well, if a woman wants to deal and she wants to marry you to come to Nigeria, how can she reach out to you? Okay. Oh uh, well, I'm on uh, um Instagram. Give her, so, give her Instagram name. David Chris Young. David Chris Young. Okay. Yeah. There you have it. All right. Hopefully you find a good American woman that's better than the Nigerian women, as you said, that will come and marry you. This is not all about married, okay? What I, why I say so is because of the only way that's, okay, let me not just say the only way. Sometimes why it's easy for a Nigerian to go over to America is through marriage, okay? So I'm not like being it must be that she must come here and marry me and all that. No, 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 no. That's not the point. So the reason is that the only way that makes it more easier for any guy from a Nigerian to go to America, to travel to America, is by marriage. That's the easiest way. But I'm not making it look like we must marry or she must come here and marry me. No, 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 no. So that's just what I want to correct. Well, I mean, you can correct it, but I mean, the impression is still there. You don't want to date any woman in Nigeria. You you gave us this blanket. I, there's so many wonderful women in Nigeria. What I've been told is that Nigerian women are like the best wives. They're ready to serve and be submissive. But according to all the Nigerian men, these are the worst women in the world. Instead, they want the women in America. And what's funny about that is 
the men in America think we're the worst women in the world and they want to go outside the country and find their woman. So it's just it's just mind boggling to me that each man well, that lives in their own country don't want their own woman. Nigerian men don't want Nigerian women. And it seems like sometimes American men don't want American women. I don't know what the hell's going on. Okay, well, well, let me just put it this way. All I just want is someone to love me and I can love, we can be together and be happy. So if there is a Nigerian woman that is ready to accept me with my son, and I don't care if she has a child or not, and she's ready for us to build a home, to be happy together, I'm okay. Hey, all I want is love and peace. That is it. Okay. So it doesn't really matter. I know that it's not every woman in Nigeria that are bad, but it's just that the ones that we come across and the ones we see, they are not just good for us. So that's why it looks like I myself, I'm just being tired of women in Nigeria. Okay. I know that are also good women here. So if, if there is any that is ready, that she is ready for us to get married, be together, and be happy, then it's fine by me. And real quick, why America? Why not Kenya or Ghana? Yeah, anybody. I, I said foreigner. It's, it's not, it must not be America. No, 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 no. It's not a must. It must be America. It can be any country as long as she, she is ready. Okay. Do the Kendra cam again. Yeah. Maybe some ladies won't give a damn. Do the Kendra cam again. You might, you, you might, you, you might get scouted. So the ladies, what you, so the ladies, what they would get all the way from Nigeria. Well, y'all ladies talking a lot of shit. You need a bodybuilder. All right, ladies, there you go. All right, all right give them your ID. Your phone's messed up. We gotta go. Give them your ID. Give them your ID. Okay, David Chris Young. David Chris Young. David Chris, yes. oh, it's about exactly how it says. David Chris Young, he's in Nigeria, desires an American woman or a woman in London. And you know, cause the women in Nigeria are not in love like the women in America. We gotta go. Bye David, you keep me posted. Thank you, Thank you so much. I love your program. I've been wanting this opportunity. God bless you. God Thank bless you. you. Bye, baby. Thank you. Okay. Bye. Ladies, ladies, what you gonna do? Listen, listen. Maybe, listen, ladies. Maybe it's time some of y'all gotta think about that African Nigerian gonna do. You've been single for ten years. Ain't nobody trying to be with you. Maybe it's time for you to, to I don't know, fly him in. You, I, I know, I, I, I know you wanna be fluid out, but think about it. You ain't been fluid out ever. So my, you might have to fly somebody out. Now I don't know how long. He gonna stay with you for now. Know what you get into. They say it's ninety day fiance. Some say you might have nine days with your fiance. I don't know how it works. I don't know how it works. But hey, I mean, hey, ladies, y'all be going to Jamaica. I don't know. Maybe it's time for you to fly it in. The rose battery gonna run out some point time. <laughs>